Cooper Cup. Uh, he leads the way here in the Offensive Player of the Year department, plus 800. Would he be your pick right now after last year's historic season, Pierce? No, I wouldn't go there. Look, we could see Allen Robinson turn into the star receiver that we've Ooh. been waiting on. There's also the possibility that the Rams start running the ball. They've got these running backs that we kind of have believed in. Uh, they've dealt with injuries. This could be the year where Akers finally breaks out or one of the running backs takes over and becomes a star, and that eats into his workload. Uh, we could also see that offensive line regress with uh, losing Andrew Whitworth. There's a lot of questions surrounding the Rams. And then also, that was just an insane season. There is just no... I mean, sure, there's a possibility that he could put up those numbers again, but he's got to regress yeah. a little bit. And as we mentioned, look, he put up some of the greatest receiving numbers ever and got a vote. So uh, I, he might win Offensive Player of the Year, but I wouldn't bet on it right now. All right, Jeff, how about uh, down here, man? Travis Kelsey, plus 3,000. That seems like some pretty good value. I'm not going to lie. No uh, Tyree Kill anymore there in Kansas yeah, City. Yeah, look, you're close there. We're, we're in the right range. Um, Travis Kelsey, a little bit too on the, uh, you know, like the, the wrong side of like whatever, 27, 28 for me at this point. I do agree, like the targets will probably be there for him, but um, I, I look at a couple receivers in that range, and, and I'm actually perplexed why they're even available at those odds. Justin Jefferson, a plus 2,800, man. Uh, I mean, this was a top three fantasy player at the position. Yes, like, like Pierce alluded to, like I, I think you have to play the Rams for some regression this year. They ran well with injuries. If Stafford misses some time, that's going to affect Cup. Like, like he said, like the running backs will probably be a lot healthier this year too. I think Justin Jefferson, though, is a fantastic target in this in this betting department. Awards can be tricky, but you know, Justin Jefferson's, you look at some of the advanced stats on him, his A dot was like four yards bigger than Cooper Cup, yet he still maintained a pretty elite catch rate with Kirk Cousins as QB. I think the sky's the limit for Justin Jefferson. As Adam Thielen ages a little bit, I think his target share probably might even spike a little bit this year. So that's probably my favorite target there. But like Jamar Chase at plus 3,500, if you just bet those two guys at those fantastic odds, I think it's a really good way to play offensive player uh, of the year right now.